thank you all uh, for the little goodies you gave me over so so many years because you know uh, doing like this is close to my heart I really I love it I only do it in my free time it's a kind of hobby and I love it and over all the years I collect so many nice things from different women who are into this hobby so I have a old yarn I have now this box where I can store the little things to put uh, in your machine. I also have old school. I collect old school, old schools. I have really pretty old yarn. It's all right here. It's completely white this yarn. And what else? Um, this is expensive, this is a lower budget, and um, these are the equipments for the original machining, and then I have also equipment which uh, isn't uh, from a well-known machine, and I also have kind of basic. I have four needles um, with numbers and without numbers and yards. and this one. I also have this one here. And I'm super super happy and thankful for everyone who supported me over so so many years and who made it possible that I have now uh, this little corner. And uh, it's yarn from a really old, really pretty old yarn. And uh, we have also equipment from sewing machine, which is super old. And um, I collected all the things. I cleaned everything. I made a kind of structure in it. And I hope it is fine that way. And the most treasured things yeah, I have them. Where I have them. I do not know where I have them. I have to look twice. Wait. You see I have a structure in the telling structure. There it is. These are all from no name machines. So, really, from uh, old machines with no name who are recycled or something like this, are resold and in other households. And I like the little boxes. I can put on little things uh, where you do not know where to put them. I can put it in these little boxes and I super love it. And really thanks everyone who supported my hobby over all the years. I never made something uh, which is for sale. You know that all the things I made for you as gifts or something like this, it was always a gift it was a gift when i uh, created something for you and it was a gift uh, when i had time to make your birthday perfect with little things i did for example for my niece i did a, a, thumb, a, a little toy uh, she can have overnight uh, i made handbags for women and uh, created other things which I not sold. I gave them as present to really people who are close to my heart and as thank you I received over all the years, over so many years I'm doing this. Uh, I have now built up this corner and I have a sewing machine i have finally a sewing machine i can trust and with the sewing machine i can work on i started with really 
small sewing machine, uh, low in budget, really low in budget, and it always freaked me out out to uh, get everything started up. And now um, I own since six or seven years an expensive machine, and it took so long to get used to it. It really it took so long to get used to it, and to make it kind of pay off because you have to think over so many things which can't go wrong uh, and which can go wrong and um, really thank everyone who supported me and for all your kind of workshops or uh, uh, something like you uh, uh, call it uh, when you have kind of uh, lessons privately um, in sewing and everything and uh, I didn't take a paid course I just collected uh, things from other women I trust a lot and all things from men who can handle this machine and now um, this is my thank you video and I hope uh, you will see it the right way like it is and that's my word for this Monday we have June and um, my birthday is around the corner, so if you have something uh, which is kind of suitable for the business, um, you can spend it to somewhere else. I really, I had enough. Uh, I have enough uh, things. Uh, I don't need any more of this. And um, that would be the perfect birthday gift if you donate things, uh, for example, in the sewing business to people who need education and who really need your help. Thank you.